Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to Dragonhead Gaming. This is episode 10. Today we're jumping into a new early access release called Besiege. Been having a lot of fun with it. It's a sandbox uh, building game, um, but more of a puzzle solving than an actual sandbox. Um, you can go in here and play in sandbox, which is a work in progress, eventually moon. But right now it's definitely a puzzle game, which is a lot of fun. Um, we'll just start here right at Zone 1, the Southern Cottage. First thing it does is start you off with this little base block. Then it gives you a little tutorial of how to build, what you need to do. Now you can build a basic one and destroy this. We're going to go ahead and look at some of the cool features you can do. So uh, let's build our base vehicle. Our axles here now. You can add steering hinges here. All right. Now, if you hit the F key while hovering, it changes their steering direction. Now, uh, just to show you real quick, while it's on the ground. So if I go left, well, you see the front wheels turn left, but the back wheels turn right. It gives me a lot tighter turning which really helps so you don't have to turn very much so it doesn't put as much stress on your uh, machine. All right. So what I'll do is we want to take our brace. I'm just going to run them right along the top here and that's just going to give our machine a little bit of support. Well, I'll go ahead and put the wheels. And you can adjust the wheels just by hitting the F key, just like you could the other. They normally automatically go in forward rotation. Now, right there, we have enough to destroy this, but we don't want to, you know, damage ourselves. So, let's put... Actually, let's undo that right up there. After I build the uh, base and have the wheels, I normally drop this on there and that gives me an idea of where it's sitting. And... I'm going to put some spike balls on the front. Now, with that, we're ready to go. As you can see, nice turning radius. Let's zoom right over this thing. Oh, poor little villager. Are you mad? Oh, squish the villager. All right. So that's it for that that one. Let's go to the next zone. I think it's progressively harder, so we have to destroy this. And as you can see, it's up on a platform. So if we were to try and do it like we did before... Oops, turn too hard. Let's reset that. Just head straight. Sort of. See, there's a big cliff right there, so we can't do it. So let's come up with something uh, new. So let's go ahead and scrap that. Actually, there we go. Let's start. Now for this one, because I want to destroy, we're just going to do something very basic. I'm going to and then I'm going to do over here empowered. Actually, let's go through these real quick. These are your basic, just to build your basic vehicle. Then you have all your different blocks. You have hinges, you have swivel joints. These are great for making trebuchets. I'll show you the trebuchet I made. These are your, all your powered components, steering engines, steering axles, decouplers, contractual springs, which is good for catapults and trebuchets, um, suspension, pistons, spinning blocks, grabbers. Spinning blocks are good. Like, say I want to uh, put it on the front and then put a blade. It'll spin the blade around, attacking everything around. All right, but weaponry oh no i want blocks oh no 
I want powered because I want to put a steering hinge right on the top. But as you can see, it's going to go back and forth. Now I just want to hit the R key to rotate that. So that'll allow me to go up and down. Oh, whoops. Let's drop that to the ground. Because you can only build within this box. That's your restriction for the each puzzle. All right. You know what? I think I'm going to put some wheels. Actually, you know what? We're not going to bother with wheels. We'll just adjust it. Aim like that. That should be good. Now I change my key mapper. Q and E real quick just to be able to. There we go. Boom. Yes, I fell over, but I'm still intact, and I win the level. Even if you're totally destroyed, you still win the level, as long as you complete the objective. Reach Insignia. Now, I'll show you how, if you want to just erase something, just hit that erase button, super easy. Now, if you translate machine, this allows you to put it anywhere you want within the box. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and add wheels again. Actually, I want to, because I want to get through there without too much touching anything. I'm going to, I'm just going to put some steering hinges right on here. Yeah, remember we want to take these back ones and switch them to get that nice turning radius. Put some wheels. And then brace the whole thing up. Uh, let's change our direction. Let's start off and just go around everything. Oops. Dropped here and there we go. Prevent any damage. We turn this thing around. Voila! That easy. Avoided all the bombs. It's a lot of fun, some of the things you can do in here. Alright, now you have to destroy, which means going around there. But on this one, you have, uh, you're getting shot at. So if we were to just sit there and... As long as you keep going fast enough, you'll avoid the arrows, but... Uh, there we go. And done. So we want to find some way to hopefully protect ourselves from them. As well as destroy those. So, let me show you some of the vehicles I've done so far. Aimable cannon, you guys saw that one. Booey! See, then I have what I like to call the cannoneer. Whoops, turned too hard. Let's try this again. Oh, that's right. This is the one I hadn't changed the. Boom! That's because I wasn't lined up. All right, let's try it this way. And you can try as many times as you want until you got to figure it out. And boom, boom. Easy as pie. All right. This is the one I had a lot of fun on. Let's see. This one... I'll show you this one real quick. This is what I call the flying guillotine. Essentially, it's almost like a top. It's got these four circular saws. And uh, one of the cool things, you can actually fly in this game. As well as have all your different weapons. Arm. So. 
show you this one real quick. Oh yeah, that's right. This has the arrows. So... kind of crazy this one can make some weird combinations the one that got me past this level though is the saw flamer it's just kind of nasty and as it falls apart it still continues to spray flames and circular saws everywhere And voila. Look at that one lo lone guy left right there. Oh, whoop. Maybe not. Let's see if I can. Oh, a couple of guys left, looks like. But that killed just about everybody. Let's uh, do this one again. I like that one. Let's see what else we got here. Ah, my tow truck. Yeah, we'll do that on another mission here in a minute. That is my trebuchet. Which I actually need to... Found these wheels here interfere with the steering. But that piston there and then... Oh, apparently they got too close. Whoosh! Boom! But that one's not for this level. Let's go ahead and do this one again. Cause I just love this thing. Sometimes you get a good... So one thing about these saws. They're just kind of random everywhere. Oh, there we go. Didn't take the arrow guys out that time. But still got enough. All right, yep, this is the one I'm going to use the tow truck on. All right. Oh, whoops, you know what's missing from my tow truck? Plow. Hmm. Gonna have to erase that strut. Do it one back, I think. Yep, yeah, there we go. Here we go. That's my tow truck. All right. And as you can see from my earlier designs, I only had one wheel steering, which really, unfortunately, was not good enough to get the directions I need. So, but you can go back and edit them. I just haven't done that yet. Up here. Mm. Let's see. I might have to go from it at the side. Do, do, do. Hmm, this might not be long enough. So I think I used a different a, a design when I did it before because I had it in the middle so it would reach out more. All right, so in that case, I guess we're going to go ahead and erase all that and you get to see it 
built. Quick, give it some nice bracing. Oops, apparently I braced my wheel. You know, while we're in here though, let's go ahead and change that steering. And flip it around. Flip it around. Looks good. All right. So let's put that up there in the middle. Rotate that. Grab her on top. All right. I want to adjust this each time because otherwise it's going to be the same steering as down there. And well, we really don't want that. Oops. Let's drop this down some a little more. Even. Yeah, see how much it sticks over now? Still think I gotta go at it from the side. Probably should have shored up that. There we go. But all I need to get it off of there. And then use my plow to push it into place. Or down there, there we go. There we go. Next zone. Let's see what else we got here. All right, yeah, this is the one that I used the aimable cannon on. But we're going to save the tow truck there. Since we uh, changed it. And then let's go ahead and get that trebuchet. There we go. I'll show you how that's done. Now, the longer you hold it down, the farther it goes. So if I just say I want to hold it just a tiny bit to get closer, as you see, it's the laser stopped it. Hmm, nice. How it didn't do that the first time. There we go. Just a nice light even. See? We're burning apart. We're totally destroyed. But we passed the uh, level. Use explosives to destroy wall. Real easy. Just kind of like what we saw before. How easy is that? 2.72 seconds. And then we just squish everyone. Oh, I forgot this one has the cannons. 
This is where we get to have the fun. Just let everything go. Sometimes works, sometimes doesn't. Just gotta keep trying till it does. There we go. Do, 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 do. Not a whole lot of sounds in it right now, just the basic music. But I'm really enjoying this game. It's a lot of fun. Oh, yeah. Destroy 80% of the monument. And let's pull out that trebuchet again. Hey, you're supposed to explode on impact. There we go. Kaboom, boom. Stray percent of tower. Whoops. Suppose it'd help if I actually turn myself the way. There, we're just going to do it the easy way. I like how you can set yourself up. Ooh, not enough. Ah, blew myself up. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. Still in delivery. This is another one I use the tow truck for. But really enjoying the game because, I mean, you can literally build anything that you can think of. Let's go through all the parts again real quick. Okay, so you have these armor. It's great for your wheels. This is great for top armor in case you have those errors. Ugh. Arrows. That was an error. Then you have your flight. You have your flying block. Propellers. Now this is good. You put the hook those on to the uh, spinning block here, and that gives you your forward momentum. Ballast. Wing panels, in case you want extended wings. And these wings are really cool. Let's see if we can't just build a really quick. Put a spinning block on the front. Actually, we need to put another single block on the front here. Otherwise, the propeller will slam into the prop or the rotor up top, and you don't want that. Let's see, flight. Here we go. And for shits and giggles. Add another one of those. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. The rotor's going to want to start automatically, so we need to have some kind of platform. Actually, you know what would be fun? Who needs a platform when you have thrusters? Nope, not high enough. Let's do our undo button here. And just put a couple blocks. Apparently it doesn't like to stand up on those. Ha <laughs> ha. So then let's just do this. Since we're just building a basic flyer here. Apparently 
the torque is throwing it off. So maybe... There we go. Wow, that's like really throwing it off. I'll have to work on that. Just just got the game. Just came out yesterday, I think it was, or two days ago. All right. So we're going to do it that way. <laughs> that didn't quite work as planned. Now did it. Um. So maybe more lift in the front. Well, it's definitely an experiment, that's for sure. Oh, there we go. That was kind of cool. I could probably set up other fans. Let's try that. We need to have some kind of bracing on here, I think. This thing might just shake itself apart. Stick one back there and use that backwards. Hmm. Interesting. Whoa. <laughs> So I need to find out where the center of gravity is. Um, is it in here? No. There we go. That's the center of mass, but... Maybe, just maybe, what we need to do is erase that. Add another block. And change that back and forward again. There we go. Ah, uh, that was kind of fun. Whoa. Yeah, let's try left right movement. Well, it's interesting. Whoa! Whoa! It's 
definitely hard to control, but it's kind of fun. Ah! <laughs> so I wonder if the wings have any really use. I may have to hook them up like steering to get them to do anything. But let's see what that does. Oh, it's actually a little easier to control. Whoa! <laughs> Famous last words, huh? Apparently it doesn't like doing flips. Whoa. All right. But that is uh, the siege. It's been a lot of fun. Let's get out of there. Don't need to see that no more. All right. Home up here. So, main menu. You know, there's your little world. Certainly, currently a lot of this under construction, like I said, just came out. Sandbox, moon. So, let's check out the sandbox real quick. Ah, oh. interesting. Gives you a, let you do a little bit of everything. Wow, we did not like that. We run away, run away. Yeah, we're stuck there. All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's episode and come check out this game. I really enjoyed it. And uh, leave any comments below, subscribe, like, do everything you need to. Have a good one.